like to start just by saying that I love you and that you are my best friend in the entire world and that I cannot believe that I get to spend the rest of my life with my best friend. I can't wait for all of our little adventures and trips, for all of our concerts and nights in, for cooking together or going to get Waffle House or Puddle House, uh, just because it feels like home or for planning ahead like we always do, or sometimes just winging it like I had to do with kind of writing the vowels because I just had ideas and not words. <laughs> you make me laugh like no one else can. Even when you say, why do you hate my jokes? <laughs> you should know that there is no one else I'd rather laugh with. You're my favorite comedian, even over Jerry Seinfeld. <laughs> I'm also so glad that we get to marry young because there aren't many people who get to spend their entire life with the person they love, but we get that opportunity. I love you, Catherine, to the moon and back a thousand times, forever my do. Dearest Cameron, writing my vows seemed like a simple enough task, but it ended up being the most difficult part of planning the wedding. I didn't understand why it was so hard to put into words how you make me feel. I finally realized that our love and friendship is something so indescribable. It sounds cliche to say that the only way I can describe it is that you're my soulmate, but that's what you are. It feels like I've known you forever. Like I can't remember a time when you weren't a part of me in my life. There's never been a moment when I wasn't completely comfortable with you not even an awkward phase. It seemed like as soon as we met, we were just two friends catching up with each other after some time apart, my twin flame. The love you so easily give to me is the kind of love I didn't think existed in real life. You never hesitate to tell me I love you more. <laughs> you continually remind me how proud you are of me. You always say yes to slow dancing in the kitchen and you never object to taking the longer way home so we can spend more time together. It feels like no matter what choices or decisions we would have made in life, we would have still ended up together. It would have always been you. I don't know how I lived without you for so long, but I know that I can't imagine living without you now. Cam, I know that no amount of time will ever feel like long enough for us to spend together, but can we just start with a lifetime? Now, in accordance with the covenants of God, and in the name of the state of North Carolina, I pronounce you husband and wife. What God has joined together, let no man tear apart. You may kiss your bride.